You better watch out, you better not cry, you better not pout, I'm a telling you why. why. Santa Claus is coming to town, gather round. He's making a list and checking it twice, he's gonna find out who's naughty and nice. Santa Claus is coming, you mean the big fat man with the long white beard. He's coming to town. So, here we go. I'll just smile and nod, you talk. Okay. <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome to day two, Reindeer Games. This is exciting, I've got Marilyn is with me today. So, we have got a few different things, Marilyn. Uh, Lori Holt. Lots of Lori Holt and a few Quilter Select. So, mm -hmm. let's start over there with that lovely big ruler. Okay, so this, for those of you who are familiar with Lori Holt, she does some things called cute cuts. And what she has are little shadows right on the edge. And of course you can line up with your diagonal line so that you can get your exact size. It goes into half inch increments. But this ensures that you have not lost your quarter inch points, which is something that sometimes we, we can all struggle with a little bit. So this is the nice big one which is six, up to 16 and a half. That's a beauty. That's a nice size. It's a really great size. Sometimes, um, well that quilt I just did had 16 and a half inch yep. blocks. So very there you go. Very for squaring big blocks. Yes, very nice. Now, we've also got what she calls her um, cute cuts in the non-slip. And there is five different sizes in here. So from two and a half up to six and a half, which is great. Okay, that's and they're available not only in the set but also individually. That's correct. Great. So we have those. Mm -hmm. All righty. Do you want to mention these while sure. we're talking rulers? Sure. While we're talking rulers, what have we got? These, oh yes. So these guys, I started with the two and a half by four and a half inch ruler. Have you ever tried these? I haven't done that size, no. I have a little two and a half inch square that's like this one that's right. very handy. But Well, this guy I find handy just to have right at my machine mm -hmm. because sometimes um, I just want to make sure that I've got something the right length when I'm adding on mm -hmm. a, a strip. And, you know, is the piece that I'm adding it to the right size? These are a great one because they're not so big and bulky. Yeah, you know, and they're not whack things. Yeah, time take to turn them around. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and these ones come in a really nice bunch. Okay, so one and a half uh, by six and a half, all the way up to five and a half by ten and a half. Great sizes. All they're all, all rectangles yeah. in that bunch. And these are all squares, so they're perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, and again. Separate, we in can get them or mm -hmm. in a set or individually. That's the words I was thinking of. Okay. Thanks, Marilyn. Okay. Um, oh, I got my hands on this, and we were talking about it. So this is your yes, your beauty, which I should have been wearing all day today while I was folding fat <laughs> quarters. It's the body right posture pleaser, and it's a weight that you wear as a harness, and it keeps your shoulders back and your mm -hmm. back straight. And I have, when I spend a whole day sewing, it's fabulous. My back is not screaming at me at the end of the day. Oh, okay. It's very handy. I've never tried one of these, mm -hmm. and I, I know a few people have talked about them, so maybe that's something you might want to think about trying. Yeah, if you find your back starts to hurt after sitting at your machine for a long time, or even as I was today, folding. Well, doing you a lot stood of folding, a long time or today. Doing a lot yeah. of cutting. Mm -hmm. Anything that you're doing repetitively or in one place for a long time, yeah, it's very that's helpful. It's going to be helpful. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Nice. Um, well, these are here as well, so I'll start with these. Our Karen K. Buckley um, scissors. These are the straight blade multi-purpose, um, all three sizes we will be getting in. And these have the nice serrated edge on them and we have the straight blade as well mm -hmm. is that correct i think yes. that was the right yeah, way we, we were will supposed be to do it those as well yeah in the three sizes which which are really nice okay um good thing about these guys uh if you have trouble with your hands they have a nice rubber 
um, rubber rubber they? handle and if you see you can it has some pliability here oh, so yeah. yeah so they're not they're not hard on your hands mm. okay these are quite nice and very sharp they they're really good um, scissors okay Lori Holt if you are a fan as many of you are look at these yeah in her colors that she has come <laughs> out with pink aqua and denim i will call it denim because i know that's what Lori holt calls it <laughs> not navy blue no her her blue is, is a is, little softer than it navy. is yes yeah so these are gorgeous um they are a five inch blade so or five inch sorry scissor the thing i i liked about these is if you have to kind of work through the throat of your sewing machine at mm. the back and snip something, it's long enough mm. that you can get in and not have to, you know, be a contortionist to try to look around to the back of your machine. And sadly, things like that happen. Yes, they do. <laughs> they do. Um, and they're just so darn cute. They are. My goodness. Yeah, I just love those. So. And then if you're looking for color, Mm -hmm. We have the little uh, bobbin holders in three different colors, and they're great for keeping all your bobbins in a row, keeping them from unwinding yes. and threads going mm -hmm. everywhere. So mm -hmm. very handy things to have in your sewing room. Yep. The bobbin bunnies actually are also great if you are an appliqueer mm. and you use our um, free wound bobbins. Now these guys are... If you're an applicator, these bobbins will last you your entire lifetime. <laughs> I, I'm serious. They will. They will. You have every color of the rainbow. Okay, maybe not white and the black. You might have to replace. <laughs> but otherwise, all of these colors will last you forever. Mm -hmm. um, these are the 80 weight. They are fabulous, fabulous threads for doing your applique work. And they do come in a little plastic case here. Um... However, having them into a bobbin bunny, which keeps them from um, unwinding, like Marilyn said, uh, you can just throw them into your bag. If there's a specific mm. project you're working on, um, you can just pop them right into your... Handy. Right in there. Okay? Mm. So these are wonderful, and like I say, will last you a lifetime. Okay. There you go. <laughs> Okay, then uh, also from Lori Holt and Keith are these little adorable. What is it? Can you say? I have to read it. Thread bling. Okay, yeah, explain so, to me okay. what thread bling is. This is so when you have your floss on a floss drop, uh huh. Okay, and you have a project. You pop them all onto this little uh, yes. ring, which you can open up. Again, it keeps all your floss for that project together. You pop it into your project bag that you've made. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> no, not yet, but I, I'm going to make uh -huh. one, yes. Okay. <laughs> um, and that keeps everything for your project all in one. Nice. All, your, all your threads. Yeah. Hey. And it's just really pretty, right? That's... That's also a, that's a bonus mm -hmm. to everything. Uh, on the cross-stitch line, just while we're here. Tammy's favorite thing. Yes, <laughs> it is. I do. I love any handwork. Yes. Any handwork, it's, it's a lot of fun. Um, this is called the unstitcher. But, well, whatever does an unstitcher do? Well, <laughs> let me tell you. This little beauty... It has got a nice little lid on it, and as a cross stitcher, if you have ever had to unpick, going. I, I may have been doing a little of that last night. There you go. Yeah. You would have wished you'd had this. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what this does is it has the tip on it is like a needle, but it's not sharp. Oh, so again, no, it doesn't it, pierce your yeah. work or you know do any damage to the top, but it makes it really easy to pop out any of those yeah. stitches that you perhaps yes, don't want to have in that think spot. I'll have to go in my stocking for sure. There you go. Mm -hmm. So this is a wonderful thing for a cross stitcher. So you can get them an un unstitcher and a nice little ring. Mm -hmm. So many cute things. Mm -hmm. Some scissors. Uh, okay. Oh, 
the diagonal seam tape. Mm -hmm. Have you ever used this? I haven't. No. You haven't? No. I'm shocked. Are, we're going to we're gonna have to talk about this. <laughs> we understand, Marilyn. Okay. <laughs> Enlighten me. Are you telling me you draw all the lines on your half square triangles? Oh, no. No. I, I use like, one of those. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. You're just winging it willy-nilly. Well, sort of, but I okay. use one of those. <laughs> okay. So what are one of these? These seem so easy from Lori Holt. There you go. Yes, in different colors. Yeah. Uh, this is her red. I think we've got green or jade, she calls this one. And denim. Denim blue, of okay. course. Mm -hmm. um, so... Both of these items are things that you would put on the bed of your sewing machine to help you maintain that perfect quarter inch. Um, as I said, both are great. I, I like them both. I, I use both. Um, this one has an opening. I don't know if you can see it here. So that's where your... Oh, cut out for the um, feed dogs. Yeah, yeah, so your feed dogs sit right in there. And you just sort of... Uh, it comes with little uh, tape pieces that you attach down to the bed of your machine so it won't move. Mm -hmm. And and they stick really well, yep. uh, but they're also easy to take off yes, too, if you and need reuse to. Mm -hmm. over and mm -hmm. over again. Yeah. Um, the diagonal seam tape, you get quite a bit on a roll. Oh, 10 yards. There you go. Um, I've had my roll for a long time, <laughs> and I really do like it. I use it a lot. It gives me the ability to do my half square triangles without marking, marking which we all, all hate oh, yeah. doing. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's, I mean, sometimes we have to do it, but yes. this when, stuff is When great. I see a pattern that says, draw diagonal lines on 234 <laughs> white yes. squares, I go, no, no, no. no. <laughs> now you but don't have to. Now I can do That's that. That's right. Yes. That's right. So there you go. Um, oh, speaking of our machine, I guess we should talk about our little tweezers mm -hmm. here. These are a really handy item. Um, for anybody who has gotten anything caught, cut, stuck, in, stuck yeah. down um, underneath where the feed dogs are or under the bobbin, um, the bobbin casing, mm -hmm. it would amaze you one tiny little piece of thread, the damage it can do on your machine and you not be able to get it working properly mm -hmm. all because of one tiny little piece of thread or fluff. Um, Day one, Tammy and I talked about some of the cleaning tools that we oh, have yeah, on. It's so important. It's so, so important. But if you run into a problem, there you go. You've got your yeah, tweezers that work you out think really you've well. you've got it all cleaned out. Mm. But there's that one thread yes. that's hiding in yep. there. Yeah. And it makes a difference. Mm -hmm. It really, oh, really does make a difference. So, yeah, these are, uh, these they're are nice great. They're nice and long. Yeah, and they're very, very long, long and tip. easy to hold. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that's good. Okay, oh, we have yeah. the fabric glue sticks from Quilter Select. Yeah. And you probably use I those use for this. applique. Yes, I do. I don't do I very do. much of, but hmm. I know she's always a bad time with that, too. <laughs> well, so I've started cross-stitching again. Yes, yeah, so, so there you she's go. She's making progress. Mm -hmm. But yeah, these are great for that. Eh? You can just And we, we are going to be, um, we'll pop a picture up into the video of the piece that uh, these go into. Oh, yes. Quilter Select. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Okay. And also mm -hmm. from Quilter Select, we have the dry erase marker. And you can, uh, and this one has an eraser with it. Mm -hmm. And there's the, uh, the other one, the Aqua Touch yes. marker, is also going to be available. That has the multi tips in it for erasing. Mm -hmm. the, um, the the filter marks. select aqua touch marker yeah and the uh, the other one is the self erase um, which is also used that you can use the uh, multi tip um, aqua oh, they work yeah right they work together at the Wonderful. same yeah so it's it's something you can use with both um, a couple other little things here that we don't have, unfortunately. Oh, let's talk about the Quilter Select Needle Minders. Oh, yeah. Those sound like a lot of fun, and they're really, really pretty. Uh, different. Needle Minders. Um, I believe in them 100%. Uh, try not to stick 
the needle that you're working on, whether you're hand binding or cross stitching or applique into the arm of the chair that you're sitting on, mm -hmm. uh, inevitably you family, will forget. Yeah, family doesn't like <laughs> no, that. No, they get really, really annoyed <laughs> about it. about that, yeah. Um, <laughs> the needle minders are great. And you can, you just attach it to your work. Um, these ones from Quilter Select are coming in, and I'm just reading my notes over there. They are semi-precious stones in rose, purples, and a turquoise, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And, oh, and this Quilter Select pin, pin cushion. cushion as well, which we're going to have a picture of. Yeah. Um, which goes it's on your wrist. wrist, which is mm -hmm. handy, and mm -hmm. it also comes in the three different colors with the, the semi-precious stones, the rose, the purple, and the turquoise. Yeah, so that's fancy. gonna be really fancy. That's that's one of those fun little gifts that yeah. you get yourself when, when yeah. you wanna have something Treat different. Yourself. Treat yeah. yourself, that's mm -hmm. right. That's good, okay. I think that's everything on, oh, unfortunately, there was a couple of things we couldn't show you guys today because we just didn't get yeah, them in, in but time. But there'll be a picture yeah, in the video. Yeah, once yeah. we've talked about it. Okay. Uh, so uh, we have the threads yeah. and the stand. Left. Okay. Which would you like to go um, with? Well, just to mention the Lori Holt uh, Bees Knees Book Stand. It's great mm -hmm. for putting your um, your books up on so that you can keep track of your pattern as you work, yeah. and if you're not always covering it up on your table, which mm -hmm. is nice. Mm -hmm. And it's a good sturdy metal stand, so yeah, it's not quite, it it's not flimsy in yeah. any way. And nice. may I just say, a needle minder works wonders on these stands. If you oh. have a pattern that is just one or two sheets of paper, just magnetize you it. You magnetize it right to that, Smart. and it stays stays put. Great idea. You don't lose it. Mm -hmm. So be great mm -hmm. in the kitchen for yes, recipes it, too. That's right. Mm -hmm. Multi-purpose item. That's what we want to have. Okay. And last but not least, we want to talk a little bit about our Quilter Select thread. Mm -hmm. So we have curated a bundle here, and just in some nice neutrals. Uh, this one is the 60 weight. Sorry, I'm trying to read the really tiny print. Holy cow. I won't <laughs> ask for anything. No, no I don't have my glasses <laughs> today. I'm useless. Yeah. Um, so it's in the 60 weight. Normally, we as quilters we often will just use a 50 weight mm -hmm. this is the uh, 60 weight cotton wrapped poly um, we got introduced to this maybe a year ago maybe two yeah it might it might be um, I started try I tried it I wasn't too sure how I would feel about a 60 weight thread piecing well holy moly mm -hmm. it's it's beautiful and I have not had any trouble. I know some people will say, oh, that's going to break. It's not. No, no. no. It, it's, well, it's, it's beautiful. Cotton wrapped yes. poly. Right. So that polyester core that's, gives it the strength that yes. it needs, but it's still nice and thin. That's right. Yeah. And for when you are, you know, having to press open your seams, things like that, it, honestly, the thread just melts, it just into melts right yeah. into what you're doing. Um, so we have, we've curated a bundle, which you'll see. We also have lots of individual um, other colors, but mm -hmm. we also have it in the larger uh, spool. This one is 2,500 yards. And I have gone through a couple of them. <laughs> yeah, and uh, I like to have a large cone in, yes. in all the basic colors mm -hmm. because Basically, you can do 90% of your sewing with a black, a white, a beige, and a gray. Yes, right? exactly. <laughs> You're not constantly changing, mm -hmm. and uh, mm -hmm. it is just so nice to sew with. Yeah, it's. Um, it, I was a little hesitant at first, but i got to tell you, I, I'm a convert. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, and then we've got the 80 weight, okay, so which even is even thinner. Finer. Yeah, yeah, a finer thread. Um, 80 weights are fabulous for applique, as we talked about with the uh, bobbin ring here that have got all the colors. We've also got a ton of beautiful colors in oh, the 80 yeah. weight. The, all of them are gorgeous. A lot of different colors that we've got. Yeah, they, the Quilter Select does come in a beautiful range of colors. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, these sets are 
you know, to give you a taste of the basic neutral colors. If yeah. If you want to give them a try and mm -hmm. see which is your favorite. Huh. Wow. And I, and I think that we have covered everything I, on the I think so. We're yeah. just kind of doing a look here. Day two, guys, that looks like it's a wrap for us. So remember, uh, get in your orders by the end of the day um, so that you can and check out. Uh, don't leave open carts. Yes, very yeah. important. Yeah, because you don't want to miss out on, uh, on what you had. Um, that's about it. Alrighty then. I think we're good. Are we set now? We can get ready for Christmas? I think we're ready awesome. for Christmas. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Thank Enjoy you. your shopping and have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> he sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows if you've been bad or good, so be good for goodness sake. You better watch out, you better not cry, you better not pout, I'm a telling you why, Santa Claus is coming to town.